Hey folks, Justin from Tackle Tactics. Today we are talking a natural crustacean profile in the Z-Man 10 times tough Elastec material. We're talking Z-Man 3.5 inch Easy Shrimps. So some cool results coming on these lately. Seen some awesome thread fin landed, mull away, and also Team Z-Man 10 times tough fishing the Flathead Classic finished in fourth place out of about 280 teams. And one of their weapons during that Flathead Classic was this realistic prawn imitation. So that Easy Shrimps has the head profile of a prawn, those little legs there for added vibration and water movement, the little antennae. And then as you get down towards the back here, we've got that realistic profile continuing for, to a segmented tail. It's gonna give us lots of action when we flick and twitch that like a prawn. And then we've got our flat wide fan tail like a prawn tail, and that's gonna allow us a bit of glide and also a bit of kick. So when we hop the plastic, the tail will create kick. And then as it falls, it will glide nicely down to the bottom. So it looks realistic, uh, both in terms of its biological realism and also its movement in the water. So color wise, there's a bunch of colors in the Easy Shrimps and we're pretty well covered from our dark silhouette colors for fishing dirty water and darker conditions. Also that glow chartreuse tail is another ripper in that dirty water and that low light. So we're covered for that. We are covered for our natural realistic looking colors like a greasy prawn or a gold flake or our Laguna shrimp. So we've got those natural prawny colors as well. And then if you want to step it up and go a bit crazy, you can step up to the fluoro as well there. So that's our sexy penny. So there's a good range of colors in there. So even across that there, you'll see a greasy prawn. So we can go our greasy prawn, which is really, really natural. We want to add a bit of pop. We can go to the fried chicken and we get that chartreuse tail, or we can go to that sexy penny and we get that real full on chartreuse with that nice coppery glitter in the back there. So you can keep it as natural as you like, or you can go more for that reaction bite and, and pimp it up a bit in terms of its, its punch in the water. So our Easy Shrimps comes pre-rigged and it also comes unrigged. So depending on how you like to fish and what you like to do, if you want to just grab a packet of pre-rigged, you can, and they're two in a packet. And that pre-rigged comes with a mustard ultra point hook built in there. So it comes with a quality hook built in, and it's a unique jig head that's been designed to fit that Easy Shrimps. So it locks into the belly slot of the Easy Shrimps. So you can change colors. You can use that jig head with multiple different Easy Shrimps. And the locks into that, so it holds it nice and firm on the jig head and it also keels it so the weight is down low on that jig head and it gives it that nice horizontal slow natural sink of a prawn gives it that glide and the slow fall and out of the packet that's around about a quarter ounce that pre-rigged soft plastic the unique thing with the jig head on this easy shrimps pre-rigged version is there's a segmented system on the weight of that jig head so you can actually use your cutters and cut pieces of that weight off the belly if you do want to make that shrimp lighter so about quarter ounce out of the packet awesome for fishing edges flats drop offs chasing flatties chasing jacks chasing barra all that sort of thing but if you get right up around the mangroves or you're fishing those shallow water drains you may want to cut that back and get down to that one eighth one sixth of an ounce a bit lighter so you get more hang time up around the surface of the water and a slower sink in around that shallow structure. So pre-rigged, caught a lot of fish on the pre-rigged version. And as I said, that jig head, you can reuse that jig head, change colors and that sort of thing using that jig head. It easily slots in and out. So there's a point towards the head section where your eye of the hook pops through and then our hook pops through down the back there as well. So nice and easy to rig, nice and easy to change those those colors and a couple of those in a packet so get out there throw them around flatties jacks barra all those sorts of fish love to eat a prawn so there's not much out there that doesn't like eating a prawn so that pre-rigged version just makes it nice and quick quick and easy to have a pack in your kit if you see prawns flicking around or it's or there's an option to throw a prawn nice shallow water structure weed beds that sort of thing pop that prawn out tie it on and away you go also available unrigged same range of colors, so a stack of colors in that unrigged version as well. And when it comes time to rigging them, there's four in a pack unrigged. So for those that are uh, more experienced with their fishing and understand their jig heads and, and use jig heads a fair bit, you may want to go for the unrigged version and rig it with your own weight and hook and that sort of thing. So 
We can rig it on a hidden weight system jig head. So this is a 1 8 ounce 3 0 hidden weight. So called a hidden weight because the weight of that jig head is actually on the shank of the hook. So once inside the plastic that weight is concealed, it's hidden. So that hidden weight system conceals it, gives you a really natural looking presentation where it's really only the eye of the hook popped out through that front slot again and then our hook protruding from the back. So looks very, very natural, fish hits it and chances are they're going to find the hook. So that's that hidden weight system slotted inside there. It fits very similar to the, the jig head that comes with the pre-rigged version. So you simply feed the hook through the back, pop it out through the back and pop the eye out through that front rigging position. And that's a 1 8 ounce 3 -oh, so perfect for throwing into those drains and around the prop roots and that, that shallower structure, hopping across the weed beds for your flathead and those sorts of things. So that's a hidden weight system is an option for rigging that 3.5 inch Easy Shrimps. And that way it, you get that nice horizontal natural sink as well. So you can flick it in there, you can let it glide in right in around that structure, give it a few hops, give it a pause, let it glide, give it a hop. You, you can fish it slow or you can fish it more aggressively and twitch it across the flats and look for that reaction bite. In terms of standard rigging, that 3.0 jig head is the perfect size for rigging that Z-Man 3.5 inch Easy Shrimps. So a 3.0 in a Headlocks HD gives us that brutally strong hook so we can take on snapper, mulloway, jacks, threadfin, all those, those hard pulling aggressive species. So that 3.0 fits in there beautifully. 1/8 ounce in a 3.0 is a popular way to fish this plastic, especially up north around the snags, down south around the weed beds and shallow, shallow structure. Step up from there to a quarter ounce 3.0 and you've got an excellent presentation for fishing drop-offs and slightly deeper structure and deeper edges. That quarter ounce still gives you that nice slow sink, but you can get it down there into deeper water. And then from there, you can step up to 3 8 ounce, and guys even fish it on that half ounce 3 0 Headlocks HD. That gives them plenty of weight for fishing rubble patches, reef, fishing for snapper, and all sorts of things with this plastic as well. So that 3 0 hook pops out just at past the base of the head, on to, in between that first and second segment of the tail. And basically it's popping out through the solid section of the plastic and it leaves your segmented section free to do its thing. So you've got plenty of tail action in there. Just when you're twitching it, hopping it, allowing it to glide, you've got a lot of movement in that tail section. And the cool thing about that is your tail is pretty much moving right where the bend of the hook is and the hook point. So the fish is going to be focusing on that movement. They're going to come in and hit that and they're right on the hook. So Headlocks HD in a 3.0. 1 8 quarter, 3 8 half allow you to cover a fair bit of water depth. You can go shallow, you can go lighter than that if, you, if you're fishing really, really shallow or you want to twitch it across the surface. So that's our standard rigging, that hidden weight system 3 0, Headlocks HD 3 0. It's also an excellent plastic weedless rig because those prawns are going to be in there hiding around structure and those sorts of things. So whether it's in heavy weed, in fallen timber, mangroves, all those sorts of things. Prawns love to hide because they're so tasty and everything likes to eat them. So, in terms of rigging our plastic weedless, nice and easy, the easy shrimps, easy to remember, 3.0. 3.0 in a Headlocks HD, 3.0 in a hidden weight system, 3.0 in any of the weedless options as well. So, that's our chin locks from TT Lures, and that locking mechanism on the front there allows us to lock that 10 times tough elastic plastic in place so it doesn't slide on the hook. So we can cast that aggressively, we can twitch it and work it aggressively. And that is unweighted, that chin lock. So great for fishing on the surface, great for fishing shallow, throwing right up in around those snags, twitching it across the flats and you'll catch all sorts of species on there. The cool thing with the Easy Shrimps as well is its head design, when it comes to that 3.0, your 3.0 is basically popping out in the middle of the last solid segment and the hook point sits down in where the head comes down to join that first segment so it really really makes it nice and weedless if you do want it more weedless you can pull that head forward and you can bury that hook point slightly in the plastic as well but it's pretty good in terms of weedless rigging that 3.0 fits that 3.5 inch easy shrimps really nicely so that's completely unweighted with that chin locks we can then go to the Chinlocks SWS. So the SWS stands for snagless weight system. So basically there's a weight, same setup with our front chin lock, but we've got a belly weight 
and that belly weight allows us that slow natural horizontal sink and it also increases our casting distance, especially if it's windy. So we can cast that shrimp right in against the mangroves and with that belly weight, we can allow it to slow fall right in that strike zone and just suck that strike in, draw that strike from that mangrove jack or whatever species we might be targeting. Again, the head design makes it nice and weedless and that belly weight, that's a one eighth on there. So you get that really nice, slow, seductive fall on that Chinlocks SWS. So when you're looking at the Chinlocks, you'll see there's no, no weight on a standard Chinlocks. It just has 3.0. Then when you get to the SWS, you'll see it has a weight as well as the hook size. So again, we're looking for that 3.0 for rigging that 3.5 inch easy shrimps. And then if you want a bit more weight, if you want to fish deep structure and get it right down there, then we've got our option of our snake locks jig head. So again, 3.0 fits it beautifully, allows us maximum tail movement, and also puts that hook point right in the strike zone where the fish is gonna be hitting that movement there. And there's a stack of weights available in that 3.0. So what some guys will do is some, some guys will only wanna fish one weight, so they'll buy that weight pre-rigged and ready to go. Others will get 3.0 chin locks hooks, and then a selection of snake locks heads in the weights that they might use, one eighth, one sixth, quarter, three eighth, half, whatever it might be. So that one there, we can switch it off and on as we need to. So again, we can fish that unweighted or we can clip it on here and we have our weight to take our plastic down into that snag. And being a Laztec Z-Man 10 times tough, it is buoyant. So when that weight's on the bottom, that prawn's gonna stand up in the air. It's gonna attract fish and trigger strikes. So there we go, standard rigging and weedless rigging. I always sent up, and especially, I say a shrimp imitation, a prawn imitation, you're likely gonna be fishing it around structure and you're probably gonna be fishing it nice and slow. So you definitely wanna scent up that plastic. So Procure Supergel scent, masks foreign odors like fuel and sunscreen, also has bite stimulants, amino acids, and UV enhancement to attract fish and trigger strikes. Stays on really well. I put it on every 30 to 50 casts or so just to freshen it up. If you catch a fish, put a bit more on. If it's real quiet, put a bit more on. I normally carry a couple of different flavors so I can switch if one's not firing up the bite on the day, but good starting points with these guys. Shrimp flavor. It's a shrimp, it's a prawn, so shrimp flavour is a good starting point. Otherwise, inshore salt water is also an excellent option for those Z-Man 3.5 inch easy shrimps. So there you go. It's performed awesome in the flathead comps. It's taken out Threadfin, Mulloway, Mangrove Jack, Barramundi, Flatties, all sorts of things. A bunch of different species have eaten that little prawn. As we say, everything eats a prawn. So if you haven't checked out that Z-Man 3.5 inch easy shrimps, Check it out at tacklecticscomau or your local Z-Man dealer. Fish on.